Hello guys, Survivor here, and uh, welcome to the finale, episode 5, Life is Strange. Now, you know I didn't play episode 1 on, on the channel, because I already did when it came for free, when I got the entire game. I didn't think I'd be doing it on, on the channel, like I figured I, I, I'd be marathoning the entire game in one go. Like, because of how much I was really in, into the game, and I found out about some things here and there, and nothing really spoiler, spoiler-ish, but in interesting. And, but, I ended up doing it on the channel anyway, and I, I'm glad I did, because Life is Strange is such a fantastic game, and with Before the, before, before, before the Storm coming out, I, I just cannot wait for it, and I really want to finish up the series with you guys before... The, just oh my god so I hope you guys that have been watching this series you know ha had a good ride with my with my personal experience with it now before we get started let's do the choices in episode one we reported Nathan I comforted Victoria I interviewed that I intervened to help out Kate and I stayed hit hidden uh, uh, we're not going to really go with the minor choices, but the, the majority of the episodes I've helped uh, Alyssa, which I feel like that's going to be coming to a play because it, it says there's going to be a freaking, uh, yeah. Um, and, and at a time, I told Kate to wait for proof. I answered Kate's call. I didn't try to shoot Frank. I saved Kate's life and I blamed Nathan. I left the money, which I feel like I should have freaking got it. Uh, because of what we found out in episode 4. I kissed Chloe. I sided with David. I kept Frank's dog from harm. And I and Frank still had the fucking gun. Which I did not notice. Episode 4. I accepted Chloe's request. I stopped Warren from beating up Nathan. Which was a, a straight up 50-50. Which is fucking insane. No one got hurt. And Victoria believed your warning. Damn. Now the minor choices from last episode. From last episode, I say I say the blue jay. I didn't disturb the bird's nest. I got David's files another way. Kate helped you find Nathan's room, which is awesome. Note motivated Daniel to attend the Vortex Club party. I didn't leave leave a message on Warren's slate, so I should have. I figured out Nathan's pin code, and uh, I helped Alyssa again. They're like there, there, there's like so much, uh, you know, stuff that they had in it, you know, all these choices. But let's go ahead and play through episode five, part one. This is, this is part one, episode five, the finale, polarized. Let's get got, let's get it started, guys. <sighs> that fucking plot twist at the end of episode four got me. God, I can't believe that Previously shit. Previously on Life is Strange. What did you find? Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody. Except each other. You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What Damn. are you doing in my door? You are so fucking dead! Oh, shit. I forgot. Psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. <sighs> Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Max? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. We found Rachel dead. Oh. Damn. I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. That was fucked. I know you're close to Nathan, but your life is in serious danger. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Oh no. Chloe! How? What the fuck? Chloe officially died. 
Mr. Jefferson. The fuck are you doing? Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your actions and decisions will impact the past, past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Which I have been throughout the entire game. This game makes you really want what to think with your choices. This ain't Telltale Games. This is on some next level choice making. We're in the dark room again. Jesus. Jefferson. I'm gonna cut that bit. Square Enix. Just why? What was your game? Out of all of this, dude. What was your fucking game? Don's not entertainment. Chloe's officially dead. We cannot go back. We can't go back to time and in time after this because we all know Max has been knocked out. Been sedated. Life is strange. Episode 5. Polarize. Oh god. What did you. What did you hope to gain? We're in the dark room. What? Where? It's a dark room. Victoria! What the fuck? What the fuck? Is anybody out there? Please help! What the fuck? Victoria! Oh. <laughs> Oh fuck. Help! Oh. Somebody help me! Oh shit. Jefferson kidnaps Victoria too? This is so bad. Victoria, wake up. Wake up! Yeah. Victoria, wake the fuck up. We gotta get the fuck out of here. <clears throat> Damn it! The straps are hurt. Of course. And right in front of me. Your fucking phone and your camera. God, I don't remember anything that happened. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. Oh shit, that's me. He took that shot last night. Oh fuck. The, the trolley. If I could move it towards me. Uh, detach. <clears throat> Damn it. Come on, Max. Yes. <sighs> Fucking yes. Finally, I'm free. Almost. Uh, kick. Pull the trolley with your foot. Oh, fuck. I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. I wonder why. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. Oh, we're going back in time where he got us. Oh, shit. Oh shit, Max! We're using that power! Oh, 
shit, boy. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. Oh, Christ. Look at that perfect face. What the fuck, man? Who's that stare there? Stay still! Fuck. Oh, Max! You fucked up my shot! But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now. Oh, for you. fucking pictures! You were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes. I still hate that word. But I love the purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. Let me try this angle. Kick, kick him nuts. Don't move! Oh. Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows and an eye for a whole lot more. As his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Good. Oh, those eyes. This is creepy as fuck. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you for Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. You, you really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe. Right. Hey, I'm sorry that I killed it, that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history, like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. The fuck, man? It's creepy. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you down. What the fuck, man? Oh, we can use that to our advantage. Max, now, don't fucking move, use it. Or this will hurt much. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. Just why, dude? Are we ever gonna find out in this part, like, why the fuck he's even doing this shit? Wow. Oh, what do we do? Still happen, so. Oh. Victoria, up here. Wake up, wake up, wake up! Oh my god. Uh, camera, photo, like it. Oh, 
I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. Whoa. Yeah, I'm yeah, go, go for that photo. photo, go for that photo. I could try this one. Focus on the photo. This might work. Please work. Some may have have happened though. Okay, Max, let's do this shit. Oh, damn. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? <laughs> Max, I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment. Innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those lucky few become my models, my subjects. Yes, you're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. As you can see, Sleeping Beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. You killed Chloe. You killed Chloe. You murdered my best friend. She had a loaded weapon. This was clearly self-defense, but that's what happens when you play with guns. Or try to fuck with me. It's better when they don't know. Like pure, sweet Kate. Kate survived. Yeah. Yeah, Kate survived, bitch. Kate believed, and she survived. You failed to break her. She's stronger than ever, and she'll outlive you. She'll certainly outlive you. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'll pay Kate a visit soon and test her faith again. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. You use Nathan. So he's gonna frame Nathan for all this shit. You use Nathan. I prefer the term manipulated. Like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious darkroom and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Why Rachel, Chloe, and Rachel? Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. I'm sorry, Max. That was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. 
With no tears, Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You're good because you stopped your friend from beating Nathan up. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with a camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Nathan's if dead? I get it now, Max. I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. Ooh. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Oh my god. Copyright. Sorry. This is not art. This. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Yo, ho, ho, ho. episode five so far is looking fucking crazy. Just wow, guys. Just wow. I, this, this is where I'm gonna end off this part. Part one of episode five, man. Just yo, we're just scratching the surface. I wonder how long this episode's gonna be, cause I know there's some shit that's gonna happen much later and shit. I, I, I just know it, but it might be as long as the, all the other episodes. Who knows? But again, I hope you guys enjoyed part one of episode five. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like the video if y'all enjoyed it. Subscribe if y'all want to see more. Comment below what y'all think. And if y'all new to the channel and y'all want to see more, sure subscribe for more. And again, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see y'all next time. Survivor out. And hopefully in the next part, Jefferson, you're going down straight to hell.